for the 2024 Betway Queen Mother Champion Chase. Six runners on their way towards the first. Edward Stone, the light blue sleeves, and the grey Elixir de Nuts are the leading pair as they rise. El Fabiolo landing up between horses in behind in the double green with Captain Guinness, the striped cap on one side of him, Funambul Civil of the striped sleeves on the other, and Gentleman de May, the early back marker, and Edward Stone forces the pace as they now make the run between fences two and three. Over Elixir de Nuts, Captain Guinness, El Fabiolo, Funambul Civil are wide, and a couple of lengths away to Gentleman de May, who's held up early, last of the six runners in the hands of Mark Walsh. On to the next pair of fences, numbers three and four, and they come up fairly quickly. Edward Stone with ears prick, jumping soundly. El Fabiolo just brushing through the top of it, but neat enough in fourth place alongside Funambul Civila. Edward Stone over Elixir de Nuts, Captain Guinness. Funambul Civila, El Fabiolo, and Gentleman de May as they turn to meet rising ground and head on towards the fifth with one circuit ahead of them in the Betway Queen Mother Champion Chase. And they're going along at around about 27 miles an hour in the early stages with Edward Stone leading them on the incline to Elixir de Nuts. Funambul Civila a little closer up to dispute second. And El Fabiolo, a jolting blunder. He's almost out of the race. He is out of the race, El Fabiolo, brought to a standstill. And he's going to be pulled up after the fifth. Drama in the champion chase. El Fabiolo is out of the race. He came to a slithering halt on the fence going up the hill. And Edward Stone was long there, but he has a lead of three lengths over Elixir de Nuts. And then Funambul Civila, Captain Guinness, and Gentleman de May is last of the five who remain in competitive action. And they're moving on towards the water. Edward Stone over Elixir de Nuts, Funambul Civila. Captain Guinness a half length away in the beige and blue and just over two lengths to Gentleman de May. So to the first of the open ditches, Edward Stone, good leap on the outer from Captain Guinness, moves up to the leader's quarters. Elixir de Nuts the Grey, racing on the near side of Funambul Civila, and Gentleman de May now firmly in touch, last of the five who remain, as Edward Stone leads them over the next, and Funambul Civila slightly missed out there, and that knocks him back to dispute last place. They've gone beyond halfway, racing across the top of the track towards the open ditch. It's four out in the Betway Queen Mother champion chase already without the star player and Edward Stone has the starring role now in front. He leads over Captain Guinness, Elixir de Nuts being followed in fourth place by the patiently ridden Gentleman de May and it's becoming a bit of a struggle now for Funambul Civil, a last of five as they come freewheeling on down the hill with a long run towards the third last Edward Stone and Tom Cannon in front. So Captain Guinness and Rachel Blackmore sitting close up in second. Freddie Gingell now just beginning to move his arms on Elixir de Nuts. Gentleman de May being held together by Mark Walsh out wide and a gap to Funambul Civila and the leaders are bearing down on three out. Edward Stone over Captain Guinness. A length and a half between them on landing. Gentleman de May has ghosted his way into third. Elixir de Nuts one paced in fourth and they're about to swing for home. They've got two fences left to jump in the Betway Queen Mother champion chase. Edward Stone has made every inch of the running so far. Captain Guinness is looking threatening. Rachel Blackmore sitting quietly Mark Walsh now more animated on Gentleman de May back in third and Captain Guinness comes breezing alongside Edward Stone. Hits turn for home, they face the second last and Captain Guinness draws on, takes off, lands two lengths ahead, Edward Stone a tumbling fall. Gentleman de May is left to try and chase down Captain Guinness who's at the final fence, he comes up well out of Blackmore's hands. It's a half furlong on the run in, Captain Guinness beginning to wander off a true line. Gentleman de May He's grinding away, he's inching closer, eroding the deficit. Captain Guinness is all out. Gentleman Debay is closing. 